What's going on guys? Some of you have asked for a review of a 2017 GOS 550. Well here it is. This is a brand new 2017 GOS 550 and it's a beautiful car. MSRP at around $93,000. That's the starting value. But with all the packages and options, this car can run up to $120,000 easily. So let's take a tour of the outside and the inside and let's get to learn a bit about this car. remote of the car that you get when purchasing or leasing the car lock unlock and uh, the awesome part is of course you can enter the car with the key in your pocket and the side mirror does fold beautiful car on the inside and the outside very luxurious uh, at a $93,000 price tag price tag it better be a nice looking car so before I start filming this car, I had a chance to drove it for about 30 minutes to get a feel for how it behaves and all the technology features, whether or not it does live up to its price, which is around $120,000, and it clearly does. I mean, this is one of the best SUVs I have driven so far, period. Uh, Mercedes does a good job with getting its GOS to perform like not only a luxury SUV but also like a sports car. I think the combination of those two really says what the GOS is all about. As for the 2017 models, the GL is now renamed as the GLS and the S stands for somewhat like an S-Class version of all the luxury SUVs. Notice that there are many improvements in this car compared to the older GL. First, you will notice that the LED lighting in the front and the rear and a bold new wheels ranging from 19 inch to 22 inches. The in terms of power, advanced direct injection engines make more power and torque using less fuel consumption ranging from a V6 to a V8 you're looking at a GLS 550, so this one is equipped with a V8 delivering 449 horsepower with a 9-speed automatic transmission. Now, 449 horsepower is very similar to a sports car. like, And the car doesn't weigh as much as you might think. It's actually very responsive and it takes corner like a sports sedan. Um, it's got active brake assist and can brake for you to avoid a collision if you don't react fast enough. There's also innovations that help fend off crosswinds and prepare for the front rear and rollover accidents. Standard formatic all-wheel drive instantly sends power to the wheels that can use it best, inspiring confidence in any season. The four-wheel airmatic suspension adapts to changing roads and cargo loads enhancing driving control and passenger comfort. Innovative options including the roll Tamming Active Curve System and a rugged off-road package. Now if you can't afford it, you can step up to the AMG GLS 63. That one equips with a V8 but outputs 577 horsepower. This is, we're talking about a fully loaded AMG decked out GOS. I'm not sure if there's anything like it, but um, definitely, definitely one of the best cars, best SUVs you can buy. Compare this to the X5. The X5 is nowhere near this SUV, whether or not we're, deck with, we're, we're decking out uh, an X5. The GOS, I mean, the way for me to describe this car is it's got a handling even better than an X5 and the power and the luxury of a Mercedes-Benz. I mean, you can't, just can't come close to that. I think another car that might be anywhere near its competition is the Bentley Pentega. Uh, and, but that car is about $250,000. So you're looking at about $120,000 versus $250,000. Uh, I think I'll stick with $120,000. Uh, 
In addition, Mercedes is a very reliable car and also safe. So that combination along with the quiet cabin and the, the power it gives, just it's a no-brainer to get the GOS. I mean, if you're planning to spend anything around $100,000 for a seven-passenger SUV, I would get this over the Range Rover any day. The Range Rover is a beautiful car, no questions about that. It does amazing job off-roading. It looks awesome on exterior and interior in terms of longevity and performance. This car will outperform the Range Rover, period. Okay, safety, gonna buckle up. This is a freaking powerful car. More powerful than, uh, than I thought. All right, so let's put it into How it feels. drive. Here we are. Uh, it's all, when, when you are parking, the car is gonna lock itself into like a parking park, park mode, uh, but stepping on the gas a little bit and it will release the, the, the brake automatically. First thing that comes to my mind is that the car is freaking quiet on the inside. The steering wheel is super light and it moves around corner flawlessly. As, long as, as soon as you touch the gas, it goes. I don't know if you can hear the engine, but it's just a pretty powerful engine. At 4.7 liter, bi turbo engine, it better is. Delivering 449 horsepower. This car is a wonderful family car. Giving you rooms for seven passengers. I always thought the X5, BMW X5 was is a nice car, but um, having test drive the GOS, uh, it's better. <laughs> so, uh, and it should be, right? At $93,000 MSRP, uh, the starting value, um, this car better really delivers the quality, and it does because, guess what? This is Mercedes quality. Hey, you can't go wrong with a Mercedes. I hope you learned a little bit about this car. Definitely a great family car if you're looking for one. Uh, and if you can't afford one, this is the one that you want to get. All right? Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Cars and Technology. As always, I'll talk to you next time.